Hello, so in this video I'm going to show you how to create your very own keyboard shortcuts. Now having your own keyboard shortcut is really useful, it's a real time saver, you don't have to go to menus looking for that tool, so it's really, it comes in really handy and it's a real time saver. Now how do we create our own keyboard shortcuts? Well, it's actually really easy so all you do is go to window settings preferences and you see that you have the option uh, here called hotkey editor now what you get here is it looks really complex because you get all the tools available to you within the software so but you have all the categories here on the side so it could be easier to find that tool that you need to assign a keyboard shortcut for you also have a search over here that you can use so let's get to assigning keyboard shortcuts so let me just uh, choose edit mesh and say I want to assign a keyboard shortcut to my extrude so an easy way so the easy way of doing this is so you have the option here just to assign whatever keyboard shortcut you want so say I wanted E for my extrude now I already know that E is being used for rotate but what if I didn't know you can click where it says query here and it's going to tell you that E is already assigned to something in this case the rotate so I probably want to use something else or maybe I can go to this to the rotate tool and change the E shortcut change it to something else but that's not really what I want here so maybe if I say I want control E instead now it tells me that control E is assigned to nothing so that's probably a good choice for me to use as my extrude so once you select it and know what uh, what shortcut you're going to use all you do is select assign and it's going to be over here say you want to remove that just click on it and select remove you can also restore everything back to its default settings you also have this option here it says list all it's going to show you many many of the keyboard shortcuts available to you within Maya so once you're done all you do is save it says it may not be available until the next time you open Maya but you can just try it out and see if that is the case so really that's how easy you can create your own keyboard shortcuts and actually facilitate your workflow and this can really be a time saver Thank you for watching.